Yo, what's going on guys? I'm here with up in another part of best builds in the game. In this part, I show how to be frost switch in the game, so follow me. Okay guys, for weapon, I choose new sword in the game for attack speed and good art of fight. The weapon name is Milady and add a chilling mist ash of war this skill make frozen fog then add frost ability on your weapon but you can choose this sword or ice rind hatch this hatch has a skill to freeze the ground then explode and deal aoe damage to enemies but that not high and for a staff i choose carry on glint blade Now for spells, we have three options. First spell is Adolas Moonblade. It's for AOE damage and long range, and you can use it for three times. Second one is Rani's Dark Moon, and make Big Moon and follow the enemy, then explode and have a frost magic to deal AOE damage. And the last spell is Glintstone Ice Crate, and for medium range and deal damage to single target hey wait wait a second what is in my head okay for talismans i use a star grace heirloom to increase your intelligence Next one is Graven Mass Talisman to rise the potency of sorceries. And another talisman is Great Jar Arsenal for boost maximum equipments. And the last one is Root and Winged Sword to rise his attack power with successive attack now time to show the armors and don't forget to subscribe and like anyway the helmet is navy hood to increase your mind and chest is carry on knight armor with good defense And arms is white reed gauntlets with good armor too. It's like the Caron Knight armor. And for legs, I choose noble trousers. For flask, I mix two status. Uh, to restore HP when you close the desk and boost your intelligence. Okay guys, for attribute points we need to focus on vigor, mind and intelligence because uh, our set need a high FP for magics and intelligence for deal high damage to enemies and we focus on a spell in this build so you need to grow the intelligence let's see the epic okay this is it i hope it's helpful for you and don't forget to subscribe and like I try to find the best stats and items for Frost Build. And thanks for watching. I love you so much. See you on next part. Goodbye.